it's exactly a way since the reinstatement of Muhammad Sunusi as the Emir of Kano, and the Emir is leading the Friday prayer at the Kofar Ariwa Mosque. For our Sayyar of Police, Kosovia, the Kila in the Katara and the Babasa. Similarly, Amin Adobayaro, who is still residing at the Nasarawa Palace, joined the Friday prayers led by Sheikh Kamaluddin Inwa. <laughs> The situation of having two royals claiming rights to the canon throne continues to create reactions in the state. <laughs> While some believe the creation of additional emirates has brought about development, others believe their existence tempers with tradition. But it's an agitation by the people who feel aggrieved that they have to express their opinion their feelings and we're addressing the government with our feelings for taking the decisions it took we are not challenging or addressing the courts we want the government to know that we feel we have been taken unawares and that we are not comfortable with what happened and that's why in fact we want to court we can have so many people having different opinions that's why we have politics, that is why it's called democracy. But in Nigeria, what we know as uh, levels of government, we have three tiers of government. Federal, state, local government. There is no way you can create any layer of government. Is Emirate a layer of government? It is not. It, must you have development? Uh, must you have Emirate you have development? No. They, what those elders, they are all APC people. I know them. We are in the same government during the, reign, uh, the, the government of Malay Ibrahim Shikaro, many of them, and now they are in APC. You, what they should have done, I'm so surprised that some of them even claim to be educated. They should struggle for local government autonomy. We have 44 local governments in Kano State. Every local government should have its autonomy, not you go and creating chiefdoms. Nigeria is a republic, it's not a monarchy. It's not the area that will bring development for you, it's your local government. Despite the tension, the stage remains peaceful with citizens continuing their daily activities undisrupted. Sadiq Ilyasu, Channel's Television News.